morning, folks. Uh, yeah, hello. Happy Christmas. Are you feeling Christmassy yet? Uh, am I asking myself? Uh, mm, not yet. Not quite. I should be. But I don't know. Anyway, I'm not. Really. Am I? I don't know. I can't. What does Christmassy feel like? Oh, a little sparkly and excited. But I'm not going to get any presents, so... Not really that bothered. No, I'm looking forward to it, for it, to it. Uh, I don't know. Um, because my children, my, my kids. Uh, I say kids because uh, the guy at our kebab shop, that's what he says. We went down there and we, we were just getting some, like a children's meal me and chids and they're like what chids they don't understand what we're saying i don't know where that came chids chids anyway uh yeah so uh i'm doing another snowman one i'm this year don't know why no snow in southern england uh as opposed to last year where we were sort of snowed under got a little rolly um Maybe it's because that happened and it's all sort of coming out now. Um, but the snowmen, um, I think uh, there's a rich vein of comedy with snowmen, believe it or not. Uh, and I think I'm kind of exploiting it. Uh, I think I am. <laughs> I'm on oh, yeah. oh, a load of crap. But I, I quite like this one. And I did have an idea of this one uh, in another setting, but I'm not going to say what setting it with because that kind of gives the joke away a bit but um, I do like dealing with the characters as though they're kind of I, d I did a thing called Santa's new hairdo where Father Christmas was allergic allergic to having his hair cut uh, and he had this big hairstyle underneath his hat and uh, these elves uh, I think it was called elf cuts <laughs> uh, I thought it was really good. Um, and then I kind of come up with this idea of uh, like Santa Street, where you know you had the snowman living down the road and the tooth fairy and blah blah blah. Uh, and all doing different sort of things. Uh, that never sort of transpired. So if you've got a bit of money out there and want to give me some, I'll, uh, I'll develop it for you. Um, so yeah, and they would get, you know, there was sort of murders and things and it would have been great. Um, I think it's just getting the money these days. No one, no one wants to give you any cash. You know, you, you get people who want to give you cash, and you go, oh yeah, all right, uh, and they go, no, 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 I'm not actually going to give you any cash. You want cash? I'll give you, you know, I'll talk about it, but I'm not actually going to give you any. Um, that would be nice if anyone's got some money out there. Give me some money, and I'll make you stuff. We'll be rich. Anyway, not really talking about this. Um. <laughs> Sorry and all. Um, I'm, I'm using, I am using a Wacom tablet, uh, and this is this is Photoshop CS4 Mechanical Cool Five. Um, so yeah, this is. Uh, oh, oh god, I had a heart attack. Then I thought I was doing it on the actual bit, bottom bit, which I'm not. I'm, I'm above it. Look. <laughs> so uh, yeah, I draw above stuff. I like to no, but it just your line work doesn't sort of suffer, and uh, you don't want that, do we? Line work line. <laughs> <laughs> I'm suffering. He's not drawing me properly. Uh, so, mm. yeah. Anyway, so this is quite a quick one, really. Um. <laughs> oh, what am I doing? Hang on. So, yeah, I'm using the brush tool because uh, if I use the pencil tool, where is it? Looks weird, like that. I mean, what the hell's that all about? Look at it. Look. You get all these pixels and stuff. Look. So, that's horrible. So, yeah, if you use the brush tool, look at that. Ooh. Lovely. Anyway, so let's change that back. Yeah, I think I'm feeling Christmassy. Yeah, if I were if I were honest, we've got this um, Christmas tree light thing on our 
roundabout. And it was lovely at night. So yeah, I think I'll just feel Christmassy. So I hope you feel Christmassy too. Uh, I've actually got a joke in World of Cow where um, the cows all just dress Christmassy. That's tomorrow. Uh, and I think after I did that, I did feel Christmassy. Yeah. Get all the presents you want. Right, so yeah, this is a sort of mountain climbing um, cliffhanger inspired gag. So uh, I'd like to thank Sylvester Stallone and whoever directed the cliffhanger or wrote it. One of the best starts to a film ever, I think, I think you'll find. I'm not gonna drop you! Don't drop me! I'm not gonna... Oh, I dropped you. Sorry! Ah. Yeah, shouldn't have worn those gloves. Yep, so. Um, yeah, I see like I've done that on another level. You see that? Just in case I cock it up. Which I did! <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so. I've got Mariah Carey's bloody song going around in my head. That's another thing about Christmas that drives you crazy sometimes. It, it they need more Christmas songs, really, I think. I don't think there's enough. Um, because you hear the same bloody stuff over and over again. Uh, I had a surreal moment. I was walking on the street and there was... There was, it, 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 there was like... Um, what was it? It was... It, it was Wings, sing yeah, Paul McCartney, simply having a wonderful Christmas time. And it was a builder, and it was really weird. It's like being inside, outside. Then I walked past a bit later, and it, it was playing Last Christmas. And I had a little chuckle to myself. Uh, yeah, so, bottom of feet. Um, I think you can kind of see what's happening. Santa Claus is plunged into his doom. Uh, is that hand the right way round? <laughs> <laughs> I don't I think that's No, it is, isn't it? Sorry. Yeah, I once did... Uh, I used to work for Deadline. Uh, Jamie Hewlett was on, you know. He ignored me at the Christmas party. I've never forgiven him! And, um, yeah, I did the thumb on this thing about a mouse being crushed the wrong way round. And uh, they almost threw me out of the cartoonist union for that. Cubists want me to take me on, but uh, luckily I was able to talk the uh, cartoonist round to keep me. Anyway, there we go. That's a bit better. Yeah, that that looks a bit better. I think it was a bit uh, wasn't looking right, but that looks that looks happier now. I think. Bit of happier line work. Um, mm, I'm having problems. <coughs> yeah, you know what I've done? I've drawn over a significant bit of detail that I think you need to see, so I need to take that off. Uh, and I know it's not quite right, it should sort of be going down a bit. I need to cut that down a bit, I think. I think we need to see a kind of stump. <laughs> I've drawn a K. Um, or, yeah, it's a bit like one of my cow's bum holes. Uh, yeah, that looks kind of alright, I think. Uh, yeah, so. There we go. And then maybe a, just a bit of kind of snow being pulled out. Oh, God, it's gone a bit. It's going up. It's gone a bit sideways. It's going a bit wibbly wobbly. There we go. Snow flicking up. So, yeah, let's colour this up. Um, so, I make two copies. And put one down. So, I've got one on the bottom level and then one above that. Just so the line work looks nice. And a bit of blau. Think 
frame rate to kill the airbrush. Um, so hang on, let's just yeah, use the same blue because I've I've done that at thirty percent opacity. My favorite opacity setting, as you well know. Um, and I'm going to do this at sort of thirty as well, at seven hundred and sixty-four. Uh, uh, yep, that looks nice. And then, of course, orange carrot. Someone was telling me carrots were originally green, and it was mankind that turned them orange. And I said poppycock because I'd seen a program where they had wild um, carrots and they were orange. So you know, uh, anyone out there who knows about uh, carrots, any carrot experts, I want to hear from you. Okay, because I don't believe that carrots weren't orange. I don't, you know. If they were green, people would still eat them and go, oh, it's a nice uh, nice green, you know, and go, well, you know what, what this carrot needs is to be orange. I mean, who does that? No, uh, no, no one in the right mind. I know it looks quite good, but you'd accept it for being green, wouldn't you? You know, otherwise everything would be green, wouldn't it? Leeks, you know, they'd be green. Come on, get real. Wish I'd used that argument at the time I would have nailed the bugger. Anyway, um, I didn't. I just sort of said no. Ah, there's someone at the door. Hang on, I've got to go. Come back. Sorry about that. Postman. Only rang once, though. What's wrong with him? Uh, okay. So, yeah. So we have this sort of... Uh, what do you call that? It's, it's sort of hanging over. Overhang. Overhangage. So I've just put a bit of uh, blue there just to make it look like it's all hanging. Uh, excuse my awful accents. I do that when I'm nervous. someone with a speech impediment and I do this twice quite often and they had that speech impediment and I did it accidentally and I'm really sorry but I just slip into it thank you very much okay and then uh, oh god that person speaks like that sure anyway yeah I didn't feel good um, but you know what I just ignored it <laughs> <laughs> so just shut up they'll forget it and uh, I don't think they did never mind off the Christmas card list right um I do things like that, I'm afraid. Um, so please forgive me, because I'm an idiot. Right. So yes, and I think what that needs, that scarf, it needs a stripey pattern. Okay. So <coughs> no, that's not. <coughs> that's an airbrush. Here we go. Whip 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 whip. I'm not making that noise. That actually comes with Photoshop. I've just turned it off. Um right. So shadow there, shadow there because it's underneath and maybe just a bit under his chin there. We'll just pop that out. And then I think on the carrots I will put in a bit of yellow highlight. Yeah. That's nice. Um do do I need that to be stripy? I think I need it to be stripy. So I'm doing that sixty percent. So you get a bit of the shadow effect that I put in before because the opacity is 60% so it'll show things underneath it and it still remain, it'll still look integral to to the hat. Right, so, uh, there we go. I know they said that Pepsi made uh, Father Christmas, what's that mean? That doesn't look right. That looks a bit wrong. What does that mean? I think. Oh, I see. Uh, but I think he was red before Pepsi or Coca Cola. Uh, I think it was an ink issue. I think 
someone ran out of green ink on the publication, like for his own or something. Don't quote me on that, because I'm probably wrong. Right, um, but yeah, I don't think Petri did it first. Probably made it famous, but I don't think they did it first. Right, so just colour him in. Dun -ba -dun -ba -dun. Right. Uh, yeah, sometimes I do the, the fingernails at different sort of tone, but I can't. I don't think it really matters, really. Um, oh, sticky arm, I've got to do that same colour. Yeah, so. We've gone climbing, and Snowman's tried to. Come on, I'll, I'll help you up. <laughs> and. Oh! quite work. <laughs> so uh, learn from this, you know, if ever a snowman tries to, you know, help you out, lift you up from, like, if you're drowning, don't bother. It'll just uh, end in tears. <coughs> yeah. So, there we are. And a bit of grey there. Slightly darker there, and I think no, that's all right, isn't it? I think that's okay. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. fine. Um, and I'll just do a lighter colour of that there because it just kind of feels right to have the same colour but a lighter version. You can go into the colour palette if you want. So if I let's say I had you know that click on that and I can <coughs> but uh, I just don't bother with that really not that much anyway um, not if I want it to remain the same sort of parentage uh, right so we come to the kind of punchline it's not really a punchline it's one of those ones where it's uh, quite wordy and it's uh, Santa uh, what is it Santa refused to go mountain climbing with snowy ever again. I think that makes sense. It, let's let's free transform it up. Oop. Again, that was uh, Photoshop making that noise, not me. I turn that off. Yeah, it's not mountain climbing, though, is it? Yeah, it must be mountain climbing. Santa refused to go mountain climbing with snowy, snowy. Yeah, that doesn't quite sound right, but it, that's the gist of it. I'm going to work on the uh, the punchline there. Anyway, hope you well. Have a lovely Christmas. And uh, if you want to buy this, I'm going to put it up on. Zazzle, so zazzle.co.uk forward slash stick tunes, S T I K T double O N Z. And if you want to follow me on Twitter, it's stick tunes again, S T I K T double O N Z. And uh, look forward to uh, chatting to you and stuff. Hope you're well and have a lovely Christmas. Bye.